Welcome to our lecture online. Now you'll begin to understand how this methodology works and how the patterns add up. So for two lenses, we take the product of the focal length of the two lenses and divide by the sum of the focal length of the two lenses. With three lenses, you multiply the, all the focal lengths together of the three lenses and then you start combining them two at a time. The focal length of the first times the focal length of the second plus the focal length of the second times the focal length of the third and so forth. Notice that left off the character F indicating the focal length. With four lenses, you see the pattern like this. With five lenses, notice one, two, three, four, five in the numerator. And then you have five terms taking four lenses at a time, never repeating. And so for n lenses, and oh, here's our little circle there. Let n in this case equal to six. You'll have six numbers in the numerator representing the focal length of all six lenses. The last one will be n, n being the sixth one. And then you have six terms. The first will be the first five numbers, n minus one being the largest one. In this case, n minus one would be five. Then you make the, the largest one equal to n. Then you take the second to last number and you increase it by one to n minus one. Then you take the third to last number, increase it by one, make it n minus two. The fourth to the last number, you increase it by one, making it n minus, uh, where are we, n minus three right there. And then finally, you take the final five numbers, multiply them together, two, three, four, five times n, n being the sixth number. So that's the pattern in which you increase the numerator and the denominator in such a way that you can find the equivalent focal length of any number of lenses using this pattern right here. Hopefully you don't have to go to too many lenses together, but at least this is how you would do it for a multi-lens system. And that's how it's done. 